Welcome back. Today, I'm going to show you how to create a vibrant design that's perfect for flyers, restaurant screens, or any promotional display. It's super fun and easy to make, so let's jump right in. I'm starting in Canva by creating a design with dimensions of 1920 by 1080 pixels. You can adjust this depending on your needs. To kick things off, I'm searching for an orange background in the Elements section. Once I find one I like, I'll resize it to fully cover the artboard. Feel free to pick whatever background suits your theme. Next, I'll search for an orange bottle in Elements, making sure to select Transparent PNG options. I'll duplicate the bottle and stack them on top of each other. To create a unique effect, I'll drag from the bottom of one bottle to cut it in half, then do the same for another bottle from the top. For a little twist, I'll rotate the top bottle slightly. It adds a fun, dynamic touch. Now, it's time to add some orange splashes. I'll place the splash at the top of one bottle, copy and paste it, and add it to the other. Rotating the splashes slightly gives them a natural, energetic look. It's starting to come together. To enhance the design, I'll search for a round blur in elements and send it to the back of the design, just in front of the background. This gives the whole composition a soft, glowing effect. Next, I'm adding some text. For this design, I'm using the word fresh in a bold, stylish font. Once placed, I'll send it behind the bottles, but keep it in front of the background. Then, I'll find an orange with some leaves and elements and place it on either side of the bottles. Adding a few extra leaves in the corners gives the design a nice balanced look. You can adjust these elements however you like, just experiment to find what works best. To complete the text, I'll add a subheading at the bottom. Align it to the center and choose a font that complements the design. Add some spacing between the letters. At the top, I'll add another smaller text element and send it behind the bottles for a layered effect.
Finally, to make everything pop, I'll search for an orange dew background in Elements. Once I find the right one, I'll cover the entire background, send it to the back, and reduce the transparency slightly. This subtle detail ties the design together beautifully. And there you have it, a vibrant and professional design ready to impress. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click the bell icon for more creative videos. See you soon with another fun project.